Hey, what's up, guys? How are we doing? Um, so I had the video sent to me, and I find it pretty interesting. It's uh, on MLB Network. Um, it's Billy Ripken talking about Dustin Pedroia and, and the work that he does off the tee. So I'll play it real quick. We're going to do a little three-part series where we talk about the different uh, locations on the tee and the different drills that he, that he does. Um, but first, let's, let's roll through it here real quick so you can kind of see uh, what was on television. Okay, so let's rewind real quick and just look at the beginning part right here. All we're going to talk about for this first video is the ball away. Um, before we talk about that, I just want to hit on a few points on the tee. I think um, I think the tee is a great tool to, to be able to do a bunch of different things. For one, um, you're able to put the ball in the exact location that you want. Um, and so you're able to work on the ball away, the ball middle, the ball in, the ball down, the ball up, as long as you put the tee in the proper spot. Um, the second thing, and probably the thing I, I like most about the tee, is that you're able to work on any mechanical part of the swing that you want to work on. Uh, it dramatically decreases the difficulty um, because the ball is just sitting there, so you don't have to worry about timing. You don't even have to really worry about the ball. You just worry about whatever mechanics it is that you're trying to fix. So if you have something going on in your swing, you can take a tee out, um, and you can work 100, 200 swings on, on whether it's getting into a better position or, or something throughout the swing that you're working on. I don't think there's any better way to do it than to work off the tee. Um, at Holy Cross, the way we do it with our head is we always start off the tee um, to get, for one, just to get our swing going and to be able to work on um, contact points in certain locations, but again, also to be able to work on any drill and every player has a specific drill that, that they like or that, um, you know, something that they're working on during that day. So I think that's really, really important. Um, now to get into what this video is really talking about, the three different contact points that Dustin Pedroia is working on. First one, we're going to start looking at him driving the ball away. I think the first thing to, to make sure you're doing is putting the tee in the proper spot. So you can see when he lands, when the ball is away, the further the ball is away, the, the deeper you're going to make contact. But I think a lot of players take this to an extreme, and they put the ball so deep that it's unrealistic. So... You, know, you can see the ball is basically inside of his of his uh, front foot. Uh, a good rule of thumb is on any ball that you're going to hit that's going to be down the middle of the plate, uh, you want to basically have that tee lined up in line with your lead uh, with your stride foot once it lands. As the ball gets further away, you're going to back it up so it's going to be slightly inside that foot. Uh, and you can see him driving the ball the other way. So that's the big thing. The second thing that I will say. Um, is that the majority of players don't hit the ball well the other way. Now, there, uh, at the same time, I think that there's a lot of players that need to work on pulling the ball properly. But I would say it is easier for players to pull the ball than it is for them to drive the ball the other way. And when you look at baseball in general, pitchers typically throw the majority of their pitches away. Um, at the higher levels, they throw in more. But in high school uh, and, and in college, they're going to basically, most pitchers are going to live away. And they may show in every now and then. Uh, and at the high school level, they show in very rarely. But they may show in, but they're going to try to get you out of way. They're going to usually start play, pitchers. Pitchers are going to start you off away. And so the ball's being thrown away a whole lot. And most hitters aren't great at letting the ball travel and driving the ball the other way. 
And so you have to work on this in batting practice. You have to work on your weaknesses just as you have to work on your strengths to continue to make sure that they are your strengths. You have to work on your weaknesses and you can't be afraid. You know, what I see a lot is a player is not very good at hitting the ball the other way. And so they don't work on it um, and they work on what they do really, really well. Um, you have to be able to take your pride and say, you know what, I, I might not be the best at hitting the ball the other way, but I'm only going to get better if I work on it. Um, and some people might look at you, some of your teammates might look at you and say, man, this guy's really not good at hitting the ball away. That's okay. It doesn't matter. You're not going to get better unless you work on it. So that's the first thing. Uh, one thing that I think is, is really impressive with Pedroia, um, and he does a great job. He can spread the ball all over the field. He can hit a ball in, middle, and away. And it's obviously he does a really good job of working at this. Um, but one thing he does that I like in his swing um, is that he keeps the barrel above the ball basically up until he gets into almost into the contact position. So, you know, we've talked about before how the really good players, um, their swing path is slightly up and that they are um, getting into the getting into the hitting zone early and they're staying there for a really long time. And that's true. Um, and I think Pedroia does a really good job at, the, at that. Um, but what I see a lot with young players, just as many guys that slice down through the ball, when the ball gets elevated a little bit, players will will collapse back and their barrel will drop early and then they'll work really uphill. And so this ball is a little bit elevated and it's a little bit away. And Pedroia does a really, really good job of keeping his barrel above the ball and then getting flat through the ball and hitting line drives to the other way. And there might not be anyone better than him at taking the ball away and just shooting a line drive in between the first and second baseman and shooting a line drive to the right fielder or shooting a hard ground ball that way. And for a guy that's not really big, you don't want to be driving, trying to hit balls up in the air the other way. So if you get a ball middle in, that's where he, that's where his power comes from. That's where he drives the ball to the gap. That's where he hits his home runs. When the ball's away, he does almost exactly what he's doing here off the tee. He shoots that ball right there in between the first and second baseman to center field, to right field, and he gets his base hits that way. And then when they come in or when they come over the heart of the plate, that's when he can really drive the ball. So ball flight is really, really important. And make sure when you're doing not only when balls away, but every ball that you're getting, you want to try to hit line drives to the back of the net. Right? Yeah, every single every single swing you take, ball flight is critical to understand what type of ball flight you want, and then to try to achieve that over and over and over again. And so there's a thought process behind every single swing. You want to try to hit that line driver at the second baseman. And if you miss under the ball, you have to say, why did I miss under the ball? Make the adjustment and do it again. If you smother the ball and hit it right into the ground, you have to say, why am I doing that? Make the adjustment and then get back to hitting a line drive right at the second baseman. So just a couple points on the ball away. We'll make another video um, looking at the ball, the next two drills that he does. But I think it was important to take a few minutes and look at each one separately. Now, 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 some cases of fair level, just taking the ball down to two. But look at Petey. There's the swing right there. What's he going to do? They're going to throw him right in the game. So the guys are sure he's going to hit the ball in the right field. Yeah, there it is. I love it. No, no. So hopefully that, that helps you guys out a little bit. If you have any questions, let me know. Leave in the comment section below. Um, share the video. Subscribe to the channel. Like it. Uh, send it to all your friends, all that good stuff. And we will talk to you later.